Welcome to Florida. Yes, I screw you. We're from Florida. I screw you. We're from Florida. I screw you. We're from Florida. We're from Florida, baby. So screw you. Never go boating on the 4th of July because you could have an accident and have to shoot up a flare and everybody would go, that sucked. <laughs> you see that? You see that? <laughs> the 4th of July is my favorite time of year to be in Florida. Hi, Tommy. Are you ready? Go on. Although I have to say, Christmas down here doesn't suck either. Hey, I'm from Orlando, Florida, everyone. Surely some of you have been ripped off there before. <laughs> Do you know that more tourists visit Orlando, Florida in one week than go to Mecca in a whole year? They need more rides over in Mecca. <laughs> Something like the camel drop. <laughs> or Shiites of the Caribbean. But really, man, it fucks with your head growing up that close to Disney World. Because in real life, there's no talking candlestick to show you the way. Don't do those narcotics, Tommy. Well, thank you, talking candlestick, man. You showed up just in time. I don't know these people who know where their drugs come from. Florida, they have hurricanes. Uh, you know what they tell you to do when a hurricane's coming? They tell you to put masking tape on your windows. Isn't that ridiculous? Fucking tape. <laughs> and a hurricane's coming. And, like a, and you gotta put it in like an X. It's like, no hurricane. <laughs> Stay away. Then they also tell you to fill your bathtub full of water so you'll have plenty of fresh drinking water. Apparently, these people never seen my bathtub. I would drink gasoline before I drink anything out of there, man. Are you kidding? I got germs the size of turtles, for God's sake. Florida, they have uh, alligators, man. Alligators never eat big people like you and I. They only eat little children and pets. And sad as that sounds, whenever they interview the parents on the news afterwards, you can always kind of tell what the kid got eaten. When Junior was at the edge of the water, and he was poking this alligator with a stick. We lost a good one, I'm sure. Surely the space program will suffer. <laughs> My favorite thing about Florida is all the grateful New Yorkers that live here. <laughs> I love to listen to the New York people bitch in Florida. Florida fucking sucks, right? Florida fucking sucks! This fucking sucks here! New York's the best, you can do whatever you want in fucking New York. New York, the fucking best. New York, Florida piece of shit, fucking hate it. And yet they couldn't make it in Brooklyn or Long Island or wherever the fuck they're from. They came here and opened a deli in a mini mall in Bradenton. And all their dreams came true in Florida. And all they can say is, Florida fucking sucks, right? Well, as a Floridian, I would just like to say to those people, you're welcome. <laughs> I really think New York accent, that's like the most unattractive accent. You can never date a girl with a really thick New York accent. Hey, yo, what the fuck, right? You gonna take my bra off or what? Don't shoot me, I thought we were gonna do it already or something. I didn't always want to be a comedian. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be an astronaut. Whatever happens to childhood dreams? I didn't always dream of telling jokes in the mini mall in Sarasota. <laughs> I know where I lost the desire to be an astronaut. I already know you have to be good at math. But I suck at math because of my algebra teacher, Mr. Bob. 
He'd always roll his. Did you have Mr. Bob? <laughs> You're the algebra teacher? <laughs> well, fucking pay attention and don't ever do this. <laughs> you shouldn't be killing some child's astronaut stream subconsciously. So I don't even know what you're doing. Are you really an algebra teacher? So, my algebra teacher, Mr. Bob's, when he would talk to the class, he would always roll his chalk in his hand. You don't do that, do you? No, don't ever do this, man. <laughs> Mr. Box would roll his chalk in his hand when he talked to his hands. Then he'd turn around and write at the chalkboard, he'd always discreetly scratch his ball. <laughs> and he would always turn around with these big chalk fingerprints. Scratch your balls again. That's all I know. When an X pops up, it is a nut scratching festival at the Chuck Bowler again. I don't know. And uh, you're really an algebra teacher at the school, man. And then you're the science teacher. Where are you going? You guys are getting it on. That's fantastic. Maybe you guys will have a little history teacher one day. <laughs> you know, isn't that be beautiful? Poor people are doing today. Yes, like my hero Bugs Bunny says. I wonder what the poor rabbits are doing today.